what's up guys welcome back for another video well welcome back to the channel welcome back to the vlog welcome back to that beautiful sunny state of arizona today Right, we out here in the desert getting it in. When I say getting it in, you hear it. You know what's up. We sending lead down. So we got some torches out here to shoot. Let's talk about them. Let's wait first. So, first and foremost, we brought the big boy out. Here we got the Saint, Spring for Armory Saint. Then we got my everyday carry. I actually bought it like that. I think I paid. Uh, Smith and Wesson Shields, 2.0, 9 mil. We got the extended mags on those, eight rounds, no biggie. But we do carry multiple rounds. And then the custom. Uh, inside the waistband kydex holder represent my law enforcement people there you go we got the gloves to shoot with uh, we got our eye protection shout out to my brother military style this is what all the guys in the military actually um, these are all the ones that they carry like clipped onto their backpacks and things like that so this is what they shoot uh, and then here we got the new SIGS 320 M17, uh, which is a four and a half inch barrel. The M18 is a shorter barrel that would look almost like this one. So we're doing those. I just found out today that my Saint, my 223 Saint, actually is chambered for 556. So at some point soon, we're going to send some. Uh, some 5.56 five, down range and see how that works out. We got two mags, two 30 round mags, and a whole crate full of 2.23. So, let's get it. He also has a Saint too. His is a little different from mine. His is the Saint Edge. Yeah, his rail is different. This one, was, it's a floating rail. So he's got the floating rail. So it's the same edge. Um, yeah, floating rail. And then mine has the I don't know what Q lock. You know, it's like a fixed rail or something. So uh, a floating rail, the barrel goes in between the rail without touching anything. Right. So it allows. It allows the barrel. It's more, a little bit more accurate for okay. longer distances. Oh, and then we got the sling here uh, as well. So, just another fun day in the desert here in Arizona, man. Oh, and if you're thinking about moving here, don't. It sucks here badly. Also. I got the truck. I just washed it yesterday. And well, as you can see, I need to wash it again.
All right, all right. So all done. Now heading back home. Whew. Thank God for four wheel drive. Um, so yeah, now we're headed back home. Had a nice fun day out in the desert, sitting in some lead down range. Um, uh, yeah, the, the two guys that you saw in the video, uh, one of them, Trevor, I work with Trevor. Trevor and I were on the Vegas military run that got canceled during the trip. And then that was his buddy. Um, never met him until today. Um, but I take my safety precautions very seriously. Because as you know, I got D and the kids at home. So hand sanitizers. I got gloves that I shoot with. And then I had my uh, face mask on with, well, y'all saw it. You know, your boy was looking right out there. They were like, hey, you look like you're about to go on a night mission, you know, jumping out of an airplane somewhere over some country, which I thought was funny. But anyway, so we're headed home. Um, it's a little spicy out today. And when I say spicy, it's, I think it's like 90 something degrees out. Not, I mean, whatever, it's 83. So we're gonna take this 40 minute, my word, 40 minute drive home. Um, I should be home at like six and then we'll get some dinner. And then we just gonna chill and relax for the rest of the night. I'm gonna go straight to the shower though because being out in the desert, it was very windy out here. Um, the dust was blowing pretty bad. So tomorrow will be a gun cleaning session for sure. But I hope you guys like. I hope you guys liked it. Um, yeah, not really working right now, so kind of got really nothing much to do. So I've been video gaming it like I'm a professional. Um, Digital Storm hooked your boy up with a gaming PC. Well, not necessarily hooked your boy up. I paid for it, um, so I got my gaming PC. Xbox up in the front man cave area. So I'm up there doing my thing, gaming it up. Um, sometimes there's some days where I've been gaming like eight, nine hours a day. Uh, on the on the computer, we got a bunch of simulation stuff. Trucking simulator, American truck simulator. I got my steering wheel, I got my pedals, my clutch, my gear shifters, all that stuff. Your boy be up there getting it. It's just, you know, it's not a game. And then I have Farming Simulator 19 on there. Um, I done made some mods and stuff that I got on there. A ton of mods. Um, of course, I got the Ram 1500 up in there. Actually, I got all three Rams. I got the 1500 Rebel. I got the 2500 Long Bed with some 40s on it. Obviously, that, that one has a special place in my heart because that's what I really wanted. And then I got the 3500 Cummings Dually with a 6.7 liter uh, supercharge. Yeah. There's a whole bunch of unnecessary stuff that's in the game, but it's fun. I created a in-game currency mod. So, you know, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just having fun. But anyway... Leave a comment below. What are y'all doing right now during this quarantine, man? Like, what y'all got going on? What are y'all doing to keep yourselves sane? You know, do y'all got the kids at the house? Is the wife at the crib? What are y'all doing? Talk. Leave a comment below. Let me know what y'all doing. Um, if you've been affected by this, like I have, you know, for my job, transportation, the tourism industry. Um, what do you guys do for a living? If you've been impacted, let me guys, you know, let me know what y'all do. Um, so yeah, videos pretty much, you know, I've come to a stop since then. I think the Vegas video was the last one. Kind of sucks, but it is what it is. Um, so yeah, just had some fun today. Send some lead down range, which is always a great time. So 
I'm on this winding desert road till I get back out to the main strip and then back to the crib. Um, if you're new to the channel, let's start there. If you're new to the channel, what's up? Thanks for uh, your subscription. Greatly appreciate that. Um, just a regular old dude doing regular old stuff. Married to my beautiful wife of 12 and a half years. Uh, been together for 14 and a half. I got two beautiful kids. Jaden, she has my heart and she knows it. She's my oldest. She's 11. Um, I mean, she's a superstar at school. National Honor Society, orchestra. She plays soccer, volleyball. She's a peer tutor. She's been on a dean's list and honor roll ever since she's been in school. I mean, Chris, that's my dude right there. He's the youngest. He's nine. He's in sports. This year at school, he's been killing it. And then, of course, freaking this whole epidemic went down. But he's been on the Dean's Honor Roll list the last two semesters or quarters. Semester. Quarters. I think quarters, yeah. So last year he kept complaining, how come, you know, how come my sister's always getting these recognitions and whatnot? I'm like, well, she's busting her butt in schoolwork. She's, she's killing it. I'm like, if you want it, go get it. And then this year... Man, he went to get it. So I'm super proud of him. But anyway, um, if there's any kind of videos you guys want to see, leave a comment below. Let me know what y'all want to see. Uh, all of our buses are parked. I mean, everything is just sitting. Uh, all aboard America will survive this. Um, so it's not like I need to go find a new job. Um, when everything picks back up and gets back to normal, your boy gonna be running hard, so I guess you can say rest up right now because when it gets busy, it's gonna get busy. But yeah, so that's all I got for y'all, man. But hey, like I said, greatly appreciate it. you guys could have clicked on any video on YouTube, but I'm glad you clicked on this one. And for that, I thank you. Well, just like that, this vlog is over, but. If you liked it, make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Give it a like. Leave a comment below. Um, subscribe. Make sure you hit the bell notifications too, right? So you can be informed because I've officially been listed as a tour driver this year. So as you can see, I'm not in professional form at all right now. Hair is long. Grays are exposed. It's ridiculous. But uh, it is what it is. So... Um, Yes, tune in to the next time. Peace.